Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. Can you hear me? Hello, teacher. How are you today? Okay. Nice. Thank you. Appreciate it. Very good. Ready for the class. Nice. Let's see. My goodness. We are just uh, 13 participants. Se les ha pegado la colcha hoy. No han venido todavía. So let's start, okay? So this is uh, the second day, right? Today is the second day of this week, but it says this is the last one, right? So we are clear that the course is almost over, right? So we have two more classes and we are done. So the time is flying so fast, right? So nice. The good thing is that you are uh, getting uh, improved, right? doing something different for your uh, language, okay? So uh, let's see, let's wait for the rest a little bit more, but let's start, appreciate your cameras, right? For the ones that are already uh, with the cameras, Sophie, Nathanael, Davey, and Mayra Xiomara, nice. So then the rest, please uh, try to open your cameras. Okay, so Sophia Stephanie, hello, how are you today? How you feel? I feel tired. You feel tired? My goodness, why? I don't sleep yesterday. <laughs> okay, that would be a simple pass, right? Ah, I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh -huh. I didn't I see sorry. Can be I didn't um, sleep, okay? Yeah, Can be yeah, usa yeah. La auxiliar did. I didn't <laughs> sleep well yeah. yesterday. Okay. Okay. Sorry, Stephanie, to hear that, but appreciate that you are here, even though you are a little bit tired. So you are in the class, no problem. Uh what about you, Nathanael? So how you feel? Mm, tired. My goodness, you also are tired. Why? Mm, uh, uh -huh. How do you say that in English, Nathanael? Se me olvido. Uh huh. That is something that Or we mentioned. Like for for head era vea. Ah, for headache. Mm. Okay, I have a headache. Mm -hmm. I have a headache. I have headache. a headache. Okay. So, ¿qué le podemos recomendar a Nathanael? Uh -huh. Did you remember? The, mm, besides that. Did you remember que se le puede recomendar? Aha, you should remember you should drink, drink an aspirin. Aha, uh -huh, so nice. Okay, you should drink an aspirin. Okay, you should uh, sleep early. Okay. So those are like the, the tips, right? The advices. Uh, let's see, Oscar, David, tell us what is uh, today date? Oscar, David. No se le escucha, David. No, bien extraño, no se le escucha su, su micrófono. Verifique ahí que esté bien conectado. Let's see, uh, Mayra Xiomara, tell us, so what's today date? Mm. 
Mayra Xiomara. Uh -huh. Now, yes, uh, David, no sé qué le pasaba, pero go ahead, David. What was the question? Yeah, what is uh, today's date? Ah, okay, teacher. Today is a Tuesday 13th, no, June 13th, uh, 224. Okay, 24. Oh, no, 20. 23, right? So, y anda acelerado ya, Oscar David. So, me. but no problem, in a few months, uh, we will be in the 2024, right? So, that time is flying so fast. Thank okay, you. so let's start. Please uh, don't forget that for today, at least tomorrow, you need to finish the platform, right? So ya usted ya sabe. No vaya a estar ahí como que a, el jueves a última hora preocupado que no ha terminado. Mejor avance lo más que pueda antes para que ya mañana usted quede libre. Ok, ya quede libre y set. Ok, with the platform. Eh, sorry. So, uh -huh, we are in the last, 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 last week, right? So let's uh, start. Let me uh, pass the attendance. Ya pasé la asistencia. No, verdad. Dios guarde. Permítame, permítame que este boladito se cerró. Y este es otro documento del otro grupo que no es... Bien, denme un segundo. Today it's uh, Tuesday 13, right? So like always, please uh, let me know if you are here. Uh, Alison, Stephanie? Present. Nice. Andrea Esmeralda? Diana Cristabel. Present. Nice. Eh, Elba Esmeralda. Present, teacher. Nice. Gerardo José. Present, teacher. Ok, Gerardo. Nice. Eh, Hilda Carina. Present, teacher. Nice. Eh, Iliana Elizabeth. Present. Nice. Eh, then we have Jocelyn Esmeralda Romero. Jocelyn Esmeralda Romero no está. Eh, José Pedro. José Pedro. Creo que no está. Bien, vamos a ver quién más. Eh, Jocelyn Esmeralda Rodríguez. Present teacher. Nice, Jocelyn. Eh, Josué Natanael. Ahí está Josué, even though it's tired. Present. He's in the class. My goodness. Present. Uh, yeah, thank you, Nathanael. Carla Vanessa Bernal. Present teacher. Nice, Carla Vanessa. Katy Jordana. Katy, Katy, Katy. No. Ahorita les describo en el chat. Ah, she's putting it in the chat. Okay. She so, has a problem with you. the connection. Okay, yeah. nice, Esmeralda, thank you. Let's see, then we have Larixa, Larixa Tatiana. No está Larixa, deje ver, no. Eh, Mayra Xiomara. Present teacher. 
Okay, let's see this one. It's not Solarisa, no, and Mayra Xiomara. So, Mirna Elizabeth. Okay, Mirna Elizabeth. Eh, Oscar Davy. Nice, Oscar. Nice. Uh, Rachel Sarai. Rachel, ¿qué le habrá pasado a Rachel? She didn't come yesterday. So, let's see, Ricardo Antonio. Here, teacher. Nice, Ricardo. Eh, Saúl de Jesús. Present, teacher. Nice, Saúl. Eh, Cindy Carolina. Present. Ok, Cindy, nice. Eh, Sofía Stephanie. Bien, coach. Nice, Sofía. Eh, let's see who's next. Wendy Gabriela. Nice, Gabriela. Eh, Jancy Carolina. Present teacher. Nice. And that's it. So we are going to um, validate the attendance one more time at the end, right? So nice. Uh, one more time, remember that this is the last week, right? So please don't forget your platform, right? The activities and the homeworks that you have there because tomorrow it's Wednesday, right? So. Uh, we receive a message saying that we need to complete all the activities on the platform, right? 80% at least for this coming Wednesday. That means tomorrow, right? And that way, the last day of classes, you won't be like running, right? With the activities and be like desperate doing everything, right? So if you can do it at before, that would be nice, okay? So... Más vale que lo haga antes y no estar ahí, pues que, ay, que ya, ¿verdad? Se acabó el tiempo y no he terminado. So, uh, let me see, now you can uh, see the screen. Let's continue, okay, where we stop. So, did you remember the, this conversation? We were, like, practice, practicing this uh, conversation that says, did you like it? So we mentioned some words right here about um, hiking, about rafting on the Colorado River. So let's practice just one time, okay? Because of the time. So uh, Josue, please be um, Eric and Sophie, okay, the two of you, okay. So now you will be uh, Laura, okay. I am, I am Laura. Uh, no, you are Eric, okay. okay. Sophie, Stephanie, you are uh, Laura, okay. Sofia. So go ahead, amiga, curate. Okay, <laughs> so did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw, we saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes. We loved it. Did you go hiking there? No. Where did I, didn't? Actually, we rode horses and we also went white water, white water, rafting on the Colorado Ra River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Perfect, nice, very good. Just a few, a few, a few words, okay? So let's see. Anywhere, right? Last summer, anywhere. Um, 
We saw the Grand Canyon. Did you like it? Yes, we love it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, okay? Actually, actually, we rode horses, okay? So, uh, rafting the Colorado River, that was okay. Did you, we have a great time. So, nice. Let's continue, okay? Let's see, we have the simple past, uh, yes, no questions, okay? So esto ya lo habíamos visto anteriormente, right? Yes, no questions. We are clear that they are the ones that are with the verb to be, right? But now it's in simple past, okay? So let's read the examples. Let's see, Ileana, Elizabeth. Read the first question. Uh, two questions and the two answers right here. Please help us. Okay. <clears throat> did you have a good summer? Yes, I did. I had a great summer. También la otra, Miss. Please go ahead. Did you play volleyball? No, I did. I play tennis. Okay, very nice. So look, these ones are the examples, right? Simple past, yes, no questions. Did you have a good summer? Yes, I did. This is a simple answer, right? Hasta ahí es una respuesta simple, ya. Yeah. Cuando yo digo, I have a great summer, so that is like a complete full answer, right? Did you play volleyball? No, I didn't. Simple answer. I played tennis, so that would be complete answer. Let's see, continue. Um, Esmeralda, read the other two questions and answers, please. Um, Sorry, Esmeralda. teacher, I, I am lost. I, 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 don't, I, I don't know. Just help one. me out with the reading right here. Did oh, Erica like her? Mm -hmm. Did Erica like her vacation? Yes, she did. She liked it a lot. Did Erica in, and her sister go to Colorado? No, they didn't. They went to Arizona. Okay, Esmeralda, nice. So did Erica, so the good thing right here is that we mentioned, right? Did is the auxiliary for all the subjects. Aquí no hay que si es un he, un she, un we, que le pongo, right? Did is for all of the subjects. Did, did Erica like her vacation? Yes, she did. Did Erica and her sister go to Colorado? No, they didn't, they went to, Arizona. So one more time. I guess we are clearing that part, right? So if, if we have a, um, let's see, if we have um, uh, an auxiliary right there, so we leave the bird the way it is, right? If we don't have a, if we don't have an auxiliary, so we need to change the bird into pass. So let's see. This exercise, complete the conversation, then practice uh, with a partner. I'm going to take a screenshot right here and let's create the groups, okay? Igual para los que están kind of sleepy, so vamos a hacer rapidito unos grupitos y en cuatro minutos vamos a eh, responder esto, okay? Vamos a crear nada más. Cuatro y la mitad. <laughs> ok. So, four groups. Ok. Cuatro grupitos nada más. So, four minutes and a half. And please, let's go back to the main room and continue. Ok. Because of the time. So, let me open the rooms right here.
Esmeralda. Esmeralda, Andrea, no sé si no le aparece la opción ahí para unirse.
Okay. Um, welcome back. Eh, creo que había un grupo por ahí que no había terminado, pero anyway, so el tiempo ya estaba sobre, ok. Eh, let's see together the answers, ok. Let's see. Uh, number one is the example. Let's see. Wendy Gabriela, you are letter eight. Um, Mayra Xiomara, you are letter B. So go ahead, number one. Wendy, you are eight. Did you have a good summer? Yes, I did. I have a great summer. I just relax. Okay, very nice. So that's the first one is the example, right? Did you have a good summer? Yes, I did. I had. So this is pasado, right? H A D. I had. A great summer. I just relaxed, right? ED, okay, ED. Continue, Nathaniel, you are letter eight. And uh, Mayra Xiomara, you are letter B. Number two, please. Nathaniel, sorry, you are number two, letter eight. Sorry, tenía mi microphone. Oh, okay. okay. No problem. Uh, did you go anywhere last summer? No, did it not? I stayed here, but my friend visited me in the weekend. We go a lot. Hmm. Okay, thank you. Let's see. It says, did you go anywhere last summer? No, I didn't. I stayed here. Pasado del verbo stay, right? I stayed here, but my friends visited. Pasado, right? Visited me and on the weekends we went out a lot, ok, remember el pasado de los verbos, el pasado del verbo go es went, ok, y este, salimos un montón, went out, ok, went out a lot, nice, uh, let's see, um, Sophie, Stephanie, number three, letter eight, and Oscar, you are letter B, Oscar Davy, number three, letter B, and Sophie. Okay. Did you take any class last summer? No, I didn't. I stayed here, but my friend visited me. And on the weekends, we went, went out. Esa era, teacher. Okay, let's see. Nice. Uh, it says right here, uh -huh. did you take any classes last summer? Yes, I did. I took, right? El pasado del verbo take, took. I took tennis lessons and I played tennis every day. Very good. Let's see the next one and last one. Le vamos a preguntar a los que no tienen cámara porque no sé. Eh, let's see. Iliana Elizabeth. Iliana Elizabeth, ¿me escucha? Yes, miss. Solo okay. que estoy de dos diapositivos, pero Eso me está veo. contando. Ok, no problem, Iliana. So help us with letter eight, eh, number four. Mirna Elizabeth. Okay. B, letter B, please. Go ahead, Ileana um, Mirna. Did you es, es speak 
speaking o speak English last summer. No, no, I didn't, but I read English, English book and I watching English movies. Okay, nice. Uh, just keep in mind that if we use the ing, o sea, si yo le pongo ing a los verbos, los estoy haciendo progresivos, right? Y este es pasado simple. Let's see. Did you speak English last summer? No, I didn't. But I read. Read, read. El pasado del verbo read. Read. English books and I watched. Okay, ED, English uh, movies, right? So please do not confuse between the tenses, right? No se me pierda ahí porque si usted me mete ING ahí, o sea, estamos hablando ya de un pasado continuo y ese no, no lo hemos visto, okay? Uh, let's see, we have these questions, okay? Echar una preguntita. ¿Verdad que el verbo read se escribe de la misma manera, pero se pronuncia diferente? Va? Read, Definitely. Read, read y roll, ¿verdad? Definitely, yes. Okay. La, la, la escritura usted la mira igualita, pero la pronunciación es muy diferente. Ok. So. Uh, listen, we are going to continue working with the with the small groups that we have. What we are going to do? So we are going to create the answers, okay? So vamos a inventar. Alguien me puede decir, mire, pero es que yo no no he salido. Usted invente que que ha salido de vacación, qué sé yo, y que puede darle respuesta a estas questions. As I told you, permítame. Espérame que van de mal esta imagen. Okay, we are going to use exactly the same, the same groups, okay? So let me stop sharing right here and open the rooms. Okay, look, ¿qué vamos a hacer? We are going to try to answer, okay? Ahí en el grupo con quien le toque, usted viene y dice, hey, pasado, right? Did you go anywhere interesting? Usted invente que fue a México, a Estados Unidos, Yo no sé, pero usted invente, ¿ok? Nadie me va a decir, no, es que yo no salgo, pero en la tienda. No, invente, ¿ok? Para que le formulen la pregunta. Did you buy anything, anything interesting? Yes, I bought. Y ahí pone lo que compró, invente. Si no compró nada, usted diga que sí. Uh, did you eat any new foods? Did you meet any interesting people? Did you exercise or play any sport? Did you work? So there are uh, two, four, six, right? Six questions. So usted invente la respuesta. A mí lo que me interesa es la conjugación del pasado del verbo. Tenga ahí a la mano la lista de los verbos. Porque es lo que a mí me interesa, que usted aprenda una, a usar el verbo en pasado. So, are we clear with the instruction? ¿Está bien la indicación? ¿Está claro qué es lo que vamos a hacer? No. Solo se le da la respuesta a una pregunta. A todas, a todas, a todas. Did you work? Did you exercise? Did you meet? Did you eat? Did you uh, buy? Did you go? So, uh -huh. are we clear? All of them. Con la respuesta, sus verbos en pasado. Okay. 
So let's open the rooms.
Okay, so let me see right here. Welcome back. So um, there was one group que ya había finalizado. Okay, por eso al final ya por los, el tiempo pasa. Había otro grupo que estaba ahí, que sí, que no, y otro que no sé al final si terminaron. No, no, no regresé al grupo. Pero the idea is create the question. La pregunta ya está, right? Lo que yo voy a hacer es inventar la respuesta. Dije que yo puedo decir que sí, que fui a Nueva York. Un ejemplo, o sea, es un ejemplo. Did you go anywhere interesting last summer? Okay, did you buy anything interesting last summer? Did you eat any new food uh, last summer? Did you meet any interesting people last summer? Did you exercise or play any sport last summer? Did you work last summer? And that's it. So las preguntas ya están, right? La respuesta es la que usted va a poner. Aquí hay unos ejemplos. Miren, play any games, read any books, see any movies, so to create more, right? But the, the answer, okay, la respuesta es la que yo necesito para practicar el pasado del verbo, okay? So, uh, let's see. I'm going to choose one. Let's see. One person right here. So, Ileana Elizabeth. So, invente, que diga que fue a Londres, donde usted quiera. Lo importante aquí es usar el pasado de los verbos, ¿ok? So, Ileana, did you go anything interesting anywhere? I'm sorry. Did you go anywhere interesting last summer? Yes, I did. Um, Mexico City. Okay, so that would be yes, I did. ¿Cuál sería el verbo ahí? I. El verbo ir sería, ¿verdad? I went. Perfect. I went. Nice, Esmeraldas. Yes. I went to Lara la this summer, right? So last summer. Nice, uh, Esmeralda, the next question. Uh, did you buy anything interesting last summer? Yes, I bought um, some um, books. Okay, okay. I bought. I bought some mm -hmm. books. Okay, perfect. I bought some books. Okay, let's see. Uh, Mayra Xiomara, did you eat any new food last summer? Yes, I did. I ate new food. Okay, yes, I ate, mm -hmm. pasado, right? I ate some food. Let's see, uh, the next one that will be for Katy Jordana. Katy, did you meet any interesting people last summer? Hi teacher, can you repeat? Yeah. Did you meet any interesting people last uh, summer? Um, yes, I did. I met uh, Taylor Swift. Okay, yes, I did. I met Taylor Swift. Okay, nice. Uh, let's see. Uh, Diana Cristabel, did you exercise or play any sport? Last summer? Yes, I exercised with my friend. Okay, yes, I did, right? So, yes, sería I, yes, I, I did. Uh -huh. yes, Continue. I yes, I did. I made exercise with my friend. Okay, I did. Okay, I did exercise. I did exercise 
with my friends last summer, okay? So let's see. Um, Llama ya quien preguntarle aquí. Sophie, Stephanie, sorry. I know you are tired, but you are with your camera. Nice. So did you work last summer, Jessica? Sofía, I'm sorry, Sofía, Stephanie. <laughs> ya le estoy okay. cambiando el nombre. Yes, I did. I always... I worked it. Okay, yes, I did, right? I always work, pasado, right? Work. During did. vacations or, or last summer. Okay, so nice. Uh, because of the time, we are going to continue. Okay, we have the reading. Uh, probably we are not going to uh, finish the reading. Okay, pero por aquí nos vamos a quedar, right? So, uh, listen, then we have this one, the unit 1314 progress check. Remember that this is sales assessment, right? Sales assessment means que yo lo tengo que hacer. Y nos quedamos para mañana iniciar por aquí la última section y ahí estamos, okay? So, en dos días creo yo que sacamos esta parte que nos, lo que nos viene quedando, okay? So please start reading your um, paragraph, okay? So empieza usted a leerlo. It says we can uh, stories, right? So try to read it and tomorrow we can just double check the lecture, okay? So voy a dejar de compartir y quiero ay, revisar el, la plataforma. Fíjense que... A ver si me aparece. No me había sacado esta cosa. Yo puedo ver acá el progreso este, que llevamos. Deje ver si me, me da la opción de ver el, el porcentaje. O sea, solamente me interesa ver eh, si hay alguien que, que de veramente le, le haga falta. Trabajo de plataforma y, y ver pues de qué manera solventamos. O sea, aquí es cumplir, 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 cumplir. Ok, deje ver, aquí está cargando. Eh... Oh. No carga, no carga. En la plataforma igual, ustedes no sé si ya saben, pero ahí puede ver usted el progreso. O sea, ahí usted tiene como unas barritas, así como unas columnas, right? Donde le dice el progreso y ahí le dice eh, el porcentaje. No sé si todos han logrado ver esa parte. No abre la página. Por algún motivo, a veces creo yo que es la hora que todos los estudiantes están como tratando de querer ingresar a la plataforma porque se satura. No me deja, no me deja entrar. Bien, tenemos, voy a validar asistencia en lo que carga casi. Si me carga esta página, ok. So. Vamos a ver. So, please uh, let me validate right here the attendance before to let you go. Okay, please uh, let me see um, Andrea Esmeralda Flores. Present teacher. Nice. Uh, Jocelyn Esmeralda Romero. Katy Jordana. 
here, teacher. Nice, that is uh, Tatiana. Larisa, Tatiana, no está. Eh, Raquel, Saraí. Bien, se queda sin asistencia. Raquel, Saraí. Eh, Larisa. Y Jocelyn Esmeralda Romero. Bien, ahora sí creo que acá está... Pero no me aparece. Ay, Dios. Coach, este, en el grupo de WhatsApp estaban preguntando a algunos que les aparecía como que no iban a recibir el certificado. El certificate. Uh -huh. Vaya, fíjense que esa parte no se preocupen. No me deja ver esta cuestión, permitan, porque somos el grupo 3, si no me han cargado grupo 3 aquí. Inglés, módulo 3, pero este dice del agosto 2022. Y este dice mayo. No, voy a ver, voy a consultar por qué no puedo ver notas. Bien, so I'm sorry that that is my my mistake right here. Pero sí, yo tengo que poder ver el progreso. Pero igual, creo que todos estamos eh, en el contexto de que hay que trabajar en la plataforma. Eh, me preguntaba por ahí lo de los mensajitos que también logré ver en el grupo de lo del certificado. No se preocupe. Eh, usted siempre obtiene su certificado en todos los módulos usted va a obtener certificado y alguien dice no pero es que ahí en la plataforma dice que no no se preocupe así le aparece a todos así le aparece a todos pero eso no quiere decir que usted es menos o que usted va a ser el único que no va a tener certificado no el certificado de aprobación todos lo van a obtener al final ok cuando usted eh, termina un módulo, eh, le mandan a la confirmación y lo inscriben a un nuevo grupo, a un nuevo módulo. Eso siempre, siempre, siempre lo va a obtener el certificado. Ok. So, estamos bien. Questions, something, something else. No questions. Okay, so time is over. It's uh, 10 1. So please work in the platform. Ya creo yo que están programados también para el siguiente módulo. Okay, so esté pendiente de su correo por cualquier mensaje que le pueda llegar. So time is over. Thank you for your time and I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay, good night. Thank you. Teacher. Bye bye. Bye, bye teacher. Teacher. Thank you, teacher. My pleasure. Bye. Goodbye.